Hi, it's me. Today I'm going to show you how to assemble this cute pineapple pop-up card courtesy of Cricut Design Space. First, open up Cricut Design Space and make sure you have a new canvas. Click on Projects and select Cards from the All Category menu in the upper right-hand corner. The pineapple card is on the first row and when you click it, it will display all the pieces, including instructions. These instructions were a little bit hard to follow, so hopefully by watching me assemble it, it will help you out. I clicked Customize to show it on my canvas and I am going to hide this because I don't need the envelope today. To double check the measurements, you can select all the pieces and align the base card with the top. In here, I see that it is five by seven, which is exactly what I need today. When you are happy with your size, click make it. I'm going to do this on a mat because I don't have smart paper and also there are four different colors. This just makes it easy for me. Double check the size of your mats for each one of the colors. And then once you're happy with that, click continue. On this screen, we'll be able to select the weight of the cardstock. In this case, I am working with medium side cardstock that's 80 pounds. And then I'm also going to click remember material settings so it perpetuates down to the other sides. All right, I'm going to go cut this. I'll be right back. All right, first we have our base card, the two pieces of decor, and the piece that goes around the pineapple. These are the central pineapple pieces, and I'm gonna put them right here. This is the first set of stabilizing pieces. Notice the slits are the same. One piece just has a glue tab. This is the second set of stabilizing pieces. Again, the slits are the same. One piece just has a glue tab. These are the outer edges of the pineapple. They have the eyes. And then lastly, we have the pineapple leaves. I'm putting all the pieces to the side so that it is easy for me to grab later. But first, we are going to need this central piece. We're going to take the central piece and align the two slits as shown here. And now we have our pineapple base. Next, we're going to take the first set of stabilizing pieces, the ones with the five slits and the glue tab, and we're gonna fold that glue tab up as shown. Then, we're going to take this piece and we're going to slide it up, not there. We're gonna slide it up right here, up that bottom slit of the first piece. And we're gonna do the same on the opposite side. We're gonna slide this piece up this little slit right over here, and it's a little tricky. Next, we have the second set of stabilizing pieces, and these are actually going to slide on top. We want to make sure that the piece of the glue tab is to the right of the other glue tab piece. So here I am sliding the piece onto the slits that are in the middle. It's not the outermost slit, it's the one right next to the central piece. So you slide it on top and it'll go in nicely, and notice the feet kind of make a V. So we'll take the other stabilizing piece and we'll put it on the same side, on the opposite side of the central piece. I mean, I think the visual aid does better than me explaining it. Ta-da, now your pineapple standing. So next, we are going to take these pineapple eyes and we're gonna slide them on top. This part was the most tricky because everything got caught on the eyes. Uh, little holes there that kind of look like duck feet. So we're gonna slide one on the outer slits, two, right here, see it's getting a little bit caught, so don't get too frustrated, three, I sped this up because it took me forever, just an FYI, and then four, the last one there, but it was all worth it in the end because now we have a pineapple with feet. If you take your pineapple and flatten it, you'll be able to see how it'll sit in the card, and these two actually are its little glue tabs. So next we have four of these, I can't figure out why they gave us four. So I just decided to stack the like pieces on top of each other. And then once I stacked the like pieces on top, I put them together using the slit, matching up the slits on the bottom with the slits on the top. And it makes it look a little bit bushy. And maybe that was their plan, I'm not sure, but it's perfectly okay if you just use one pair of them. Then you take it and you slide it as best you can on top of the pineapple. It is a little bit tricky, but I found that if one of the little loose pieces, like what I'm showing right here, is on one side and the other loose piece on the other side, it's fine. You're gonna have to glue those down, otherwise the pineapple piece will, uh, or the pineapple leaves will fall off. So I'm gluing them down to help support it. Um, yeah, you'll have to like finagle that one through. 
So here it is. Here's our cute little pineapple. She's really cute. She, he, whatever. It's got feet and it's standing and I love it. It's so cute. All right, so these pieces are actually going to hold our pineapple in place. They've placed slits in them, and we're gonna take the little pineapple feet and we're gonna slide them through. Make sure that those slits are pointing up, um, or they're pointing in the same direction, really, is what matters. So then we're gonna take this guy and we're gonna slide the other pineapple foot through that hole. And it looks good. So once you're happy with the way it's sitting, we're gonna glue that tab down to make it easy for us later. So we glue it down, and now its feet are glued to, I, I guess you could call this a platform. Uh, you could call it that, it's cute. And here's what our pineapple's gonna open and close inside of the card. And we'll put that to the side. So now we're gonna fold our base card in half. I actually think I cut the wrong side of the card because one side is textured and one isn't, but it's okay. Then I'm gonna glue these pieces of decor down into the card um, so that it's cute. Make sure when you glue it, you avoid the little pineapple hole on the base card. Otherwise your glue is gonna spill out and get all over your table. So glue it carefully. Now we're going to glue this side of the pineapple to the right side of the base card. Apply your glue, maybe not as much glue as I did. I'm always paranoid that it's not gonna stick, so I tend to over glue. Please do better than me. And here I am aligning up the blue piece with the edge of the white piece. So the edges are aligned together. Apply glue onto this side while that side is drying and then close your card. Give the glue a little bit of time to dry, and when you open up your card, you have a pop-up pineapple. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please comment below, and I'll happily respond. Take care, and have a great day.